Did you hear the Cybertruck price could hit close to $80,000 by the end of the year? Stay with us to uncover the latest updates about the Cybertruck. Tesla CEO Elon Musk has finally brought to life the highly anticipated Tesla Cybertruck. And we've got the latest scoop on what's been happening with its production, pricing and deliveries. Stick around for an all-round ride through the world of Tesla's new masterpiece. Without further ado, let's get started. On November 21, 2019, the prototype Tesla Cybertruck was showcased for the first time at the unveiling event in Los Angeles. People were really excited and couldn't wait for the launch day. Everyone was talking about the new electric truck from Tesla. They were curious about what it would look like when it was unveiled. It left people in awe, sparking curiosity about what the Tesla Cybertruck truly offers. It was a big day which made people think about the future of cars. Fast forward to 2023, Elon Musk stated that the Tesla Cybertruck is production ready and that he had just driven this futuristic lifestyle vehicle. He made this statement in a post on X saying, just drove the production candidate Cybertruck at Tesla Giga Texas. This drew a lot of buzz and reactions from people on X about the Tesla Cybertruck. Recently, there's been a buzz in the Tesla community as multiple Tesla Cybertrucks were spotted at the superchargers located at Giga Texas. These sightings have sparked speculations that the electric pickup truck is inching closer to customer deliveries. The Cybertruck has been delayed many times. This has disappointed fans and people who reserved one. Elon Musk, the CEO of Tesla, has been open about these delays, blaming issues like supply problems and design changes. But there are more reasons for the delays, like technical problems, strategic decisions and production challenges. Speaking of production challenges, the Cybertruck wasn't an easy feat. Its outer body is made up of 304L stainless steel and special armored glass, and depending on the motor variants, it can go a maximum range of 500 miles on a single charge. So making a near-perfect electric pickup truck like this takes time, especially when using new technology. Elon Musk said they were trying to make the Cybertruck's design simpler while keeping its cool features, which is a big challenge when trying to make a whole new type of vehicle. The COVID-19 pandemic disrupted supply chains worldwide, affecting Tesla too. Musk mentioned difficulties in getting computer chips and shipping materials on time, especially for the unique parts in the Cybertruck. Tesla prioritized making and selling other cars like the Model Y before the Cybertruck to secure its place in the car market. When Tesla first introduced the concept of the Cybertruck, there were no other electric pickup trucks around. But now there are competitors like Rivian, Ford and GM. Each of these trucks has its own features which made Tesla invest more time to ensure the Cybertruck stands out from its rivals. Meanwhile, getting approval from regulators and passing safety checks can take a lot of time, especially for a unique vehicle like the Cybertruck. As Musk wants the truck to be used for multiple purposes, not just driving on the road, so it needs to meet high safety and performance standards. Tesla fans were very excited and had high expectations about the Cybertruck. Musk has made big promises and he needs to deliver. Delaying the truck was a way to make sure it meets people's expectations. Musk is also involved in other projects like SpaceX and Neuralink. Managing all of these takes a lot of his time and attention, which could be one of the reasons for Cybertruck's progress. However, the delays were frustrating, but it was necessary to ensure the Cybertruck stands out in the electric pickup market. Musk has a history of overcoming challenges, and Tesla has a track record of changing the car industry. So even though it took a longer time, the Cybertruck was worth the wait. When Tesla started making the Cybertruck, they faced some major problems. The Cybertruck's special metal skin was tough to build with normal methods, so Tesla had to use robots and special welding machines to make it right. Getting the super strong steel they needed was also a headache. They had to make deals with steel dynamics to make sure they always had enough of it. The rear of the Cybertruck was hard to make because it was so big and complicated, but Tesla kept trying different ways until they got it right. Batteries were just as important, Tesla decided to make their own to make sure they always had enough and to make sure they were of good quality. They built gigafactories, at least that's what they call it, to make the production faster and better. These factories make both the Cybertruck's parts and batteries which are located in Texas and California. And looking ahead, Tesla might open another factory in France with the country eager to welcome them and support green initiatives. It's a big year for Tesla with all these changes and new factories. 
Tesla also listened to what people said about the Cybertruck and used that to make it better. They aim to make the Cybertruck perfect for the people who want it. Tesla is apparently aiming for the production of 375,000 units per year for the Cybertruck, which is an amazing feat. Let's talk about the design and features of the Cybertruck. The Cybertruck's exoskeleton body is mainly made from an ultra-hard stainless steel called 304L stainless steel from Steel Dynamics. This steel is so strong and doesn't rust, which helps for the Cybertruck's durability and longevity. Now, how did they put the Cybertruck together, you might be asking? Well, let's walk through the process together. First, they take big sheets of this ultra-hard stainless steel and cut them into the right shapes for the Cybertruck's body parts, like the doors and panels. Then they use machines to bend and shape these pieces into the Cybertruck's unique angular design. For the windows, they use something called Tesla Armor Glass, an armored glass built to ensure resistance to cracks and shattering, prioritizing your safety in the vehicle. This is an improvement from the glass used on the prototype during the launch event in 2019. In terms of its electric power source, the Cybertruck relies on larger batteries for operation. These batteries function similarly to the battery in a smartphone, but on a much larger scale. The Cybertruck is equipped with electric motors that harness the stored electricity to propel the wheels and move the truck. As a result, the Cybertruck eliminates the need for gasoline, making it a more environmentally friendly alternative to conventional trucks. As of July 2022, the start of limited production was estimated to start in mid-2023. As of January 2023, the start of mass production was estimated to be in 2024. However, in February 2023, Elon Musk stated that the Cybertruck would be available later in 2023, with deliveries planned to begin by the end of Q3 2023. The Cybertruck has been pre-ordered by more than 1.9 million people. That is more than the entire population of, let's say, Phoenix or Philadelphia. People continue to reserve an electric pickup truck, even though waiting times have become so long. How to pre-order? Visit the Tesla website and select the Cybertruck from the drop-down menu to place a pre-order for the vehicle. After that, you'll be given the opportunity to select the configuration and options that best suit your needs, as well as provide a deposit of $100 that will be refunded to you. Reserving your Cybertruck gives you a unique RN or reservation number that will be used to mark your spot in line for when the Cybertruck starts rolling out. The original price for the rear-wheel drive Cybertruck was $40,000, then it went up to $50,000 for the all-wheel drive version and $60,000 for the tri-motor version. Now it seems the official price is around $75,000. Some people heard it could be in the mid to high 70,000s, so around $75,000 seems likely, but we don't know the exact details like battery size and range. Tesla invited some high-profile people to announce the first Cybertruck deliveries, and they were told it would start around $75,000, but it's a bit unclear and Tesla might be keeping things vague on purpose. The Cybertruck has changed from its original $40,000 plan. It's now more of a premium truck with all-wheel drive. The price increase reflects these changes. The first Cybertruck delivery should happen in the next three to four weeks, and those who referred others might get invitations to the launch event. Tesla's strategy for the order of deliveries is unclear, and people might get frustrated if it's not based on who ordered first. So the main point is, the Cybertruck's price has gone up, and there's still some uncertainty about the exact details and delivery order. What are your thoughts on these speculations? Would you be getting one for yourself? How do you feel about Tesla's ambitious plans for the Cybertruck? Let us know in the comments. Remember to subscribe and hit notifications to be among the first in line for more thrilling and electrifying updates. So there you have it folks, the exciting journey of Tesla's Cybertruck so far. Until next time, stay charged and keep those wheels turning. See you in the next video.